and all done. Our room is gonna look the best. Mom, are you sure Cousin Cindy is gonna be here today? Yeah, I'm sure because she did tell me, Mom, she told you more than like a thousand times and she never came then. That was just three times, okay? Nothing's gonna happen. And this time I'm sure that she's gonna come because she did pinky promise me. She pinky promised? Then she better come. She's gonna break her pinky promise. Oh, I feel so tired after doing it. Well, um, you should better get ready because you don't look ready. And cousin, and of course, Stinzy is gonna be here any moment. Yeah, uh, yeah, Stinzy is the person who judged the sixth Anil Woods fashion show. Like, you know, she was like the anchor. And if you didn't watch it, go and watch it. Don't forget to watch it. I posted it on hashtag be good do good by Ishan Baby. Just, just, you know, let's just do this. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, maybe, yeah, I should take a shower. I'll go and take a shower, mom. Mom, I'm back from the shower. Ugh, now can I just like wait for her to come? Yeah, I'm pretty sure she's gonna come. So I'm just gonna go and get the laundry clothes that you, that. I mean, laundry clothes? Oh yeah, I better not tell you. The laundry clothes, you know, I should do the laundry. <laughs> yeah. Hey guys, so, Sinji did tell me to bring a lot of old giant socks because they're gonna make dresses for them because my daughter does not have a lot of dresses and she loves dresses and Sinji's gonna be coming any moment and I don't want her to know because she did tell Riley that don't tell Evie because it's gonna be a surprise. So yeah, anyway, I'm gonna be Okay, so Stinzy's gonna come any moment. Oh, Stinzy's gonna come any moment. Oh no, what should I do? Stinzy, oh, uh, what should I do? Uh, should I, should I? Oh no, my just all fell out. Put it back, okay, great. Uh, what, what if she thinks that he took the biggest side of the table? I'm just thinking, oh no, 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 I'm getting scared. Oh no, maybe I should just do some meditation. Um, meditation, ding dong. Um, I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. I'm just going with it. Okay. Hi. Huh. Stinzy, it's finally you. I've been waiting to see you for like a thousand years. Really? You weren't even born a thousand years ago. Okay, so whose room is this? Is it your room? No, it's our room. Remember, you're gonna be moving in with us forever. Yeah, but do you think this is all too kiddish for me? Nah, I think you're still a kid, so just go with the flow. Okay, I guess so. Oh my god, is this my bed? Yep, it sure is. A cute emoji bed. I love emojis. I knew it. You like it. I knew it. Yes. So that's my bed. Don't mind if my bed is, like, bigger. But still small in size. And don't mind be taking the, uh, taking, because I'm taking the bigger side of the table. Nah, it's fine. Because, yeah, I know you're just used to taking the big stuff. So, yeah, I guess it's fine. Oh, you remember Dolly. Yeah. I still remember Dolly. And you remember Kristoff. Kristoff the whale. I'm not talking about the Kristoff the snowman, okay? I'm talking about the whale that I named Kristoff. Because I was like a huge fan of Frozen that time. So I just had to name my Kristoff. I was like a small kid. Yeah, I remember. Let me go back in that age. Ah, uh, yeah, maybe later. I did not have brown hair. I had, like, blonde hair. Yeah, because I just, like, I don't like the color blonde so much. So I colored my hair brown. I look horrible at that time. Yep, I did look horrible. I like horrible. Well, I did have, like, brown hair in the starting, but then my mom dyed it blonde because she really, really liked brown. Like, technically, my real color hair is brown only. Maybe I'll show you a video of me, like, in call, playing with Kristoff, my veil. Don't forget. Yeah, of course. So, yeah. I have, like, a lot of fun things fun for us to do. Evie? Really, Stinzy? Yep. Really. So, yeah. Just a minute. Um, uh, Mom, I did tell you to bring in something. Yeah, yeah, wait. I'm bringing it. Ugh. Here are the clothes, like the pile of clothes that you told me to drop off. Okay, so that's great. 
Well, bye, mom. Can you go to the room? Yeah, right. Oh, since when did you become like this? I thought you were supposed to ask me, like, please, can you go to the room? Something like that. Yeah, mom, I'm grown up. I'm not too small like Evie. Still, I'm angry to you. Well, anyway, I better get going. I was flying because I know you have magic. You know. So yeah, today we're going to do some, we're going to make some dresses for you and me. Dresses? Really? Yup, really. So let's get started. First, we will need a pile of old socks for this DIY dress, whatever it is called. And then we will need a scissor. Okay, so yeah. Hey, look, Evie. We, I got you this giant squeezy ball. It's kind of like a pet. Oh, it actually moves. But we already have a pet. Oh, you have a pet? You didn't tell me. Oh, yeah, we forgot to tell you about the pet. Sorry. Oh, it's just a minute. I'll go and call her. Just a minute. I'll just go and get her. Okay, so here she is. Oh, he's so cute. Don't, don't buy me. I'm like, I'm friendly. Her name's Crystal. Oh, hi, Crystal. I'm, I'm, don't worry, I'm not going to harm you. Oh, you're such a cute girl. Bow, bow, bow. Right, he went back home. She, I mean. I get so confused between dogs. Right, so let's make some clothes. So first, take like a sock, an old sock. And yeah, just... You need like, if you need dresses for 10 to 12 inch tall, like um, 10 to 12 inch tall, like that. I think that's, it stands around 10 to 11 inch inches. Yeah. So, yeah, if you need a dress for like that tall or a small around, it stands around 4 to 5 inches, I guess. I'm not sure because I don't have an inch scale. So, yeah, I'm just going to make a few dresses. And I'm pretty sure you're going to learn how to do them because they're very easy to make. I'm just going to make them in with the help of the magical dress in 3, 2, 1. Okay, so take a doll standing around, I'm not sure, 6 inches I guess. Measure it and cut. And cut a hole for the hands and for the neck because it's going to be like a frock top. So here we are. I just cut some holes and then then next put it on the dog. 